Hello everyone. Would like some some would somebody like to go back to um the past? Well, trace effects from the future. He the student uh who accidentally traveled backward through time. In order to return home, Trace must help six pe people across the country at pivotal moments in their own lives. So, he has to do different things to make a better future for tomorrow. Trace will need to speak with so many people and collect many words and items to solve each mission. Could you help Trace to complete the seven missions so he can return home to the future? Now, this is how to play the game. So you go to here, click ch chapter one, and then you go click start over. University. So this is a science lab. Now Trace is gonna jump to here. This is a time machine. So Trace jumped on that time machine. It took him to the past. Hey, how exciting! This is Eddie sitting tight, eating his lunch. Enjoying your lunch. And suddenly, what's gonna happen? Oh my God! Look at that! Good heavens! That's quick, Eddie. Help me. Let's carry this boy to my lab. He's hurt. Ah, okay. I know your name. We found your student ID. What happened? Dude, you're from the future. Very important. You must leave. Or you can't come home. I repeat, find Emma Fields. You have to turn Fields, or you won't return home to the future. Eddie, help Trace find Emma Fields. Then we're gonna press continue to continue the game. Now this is Eddie, and this is here. This is the, how the game is gonna start. This is uh, Trace, he's gonna move here, he's gonna go to Eddie. And then we're gonna press, you see this letter E, so we have to press the letter E. So press the computer, letter E, and then this screen is gonna come up. Now we're gonna choose Eddie, or are you Eddie? So we're gonna choose hi Eddie because he knew him. Eddie. Close this. Hi. Close this. And then you say let's go, or you get to choose one of these. So it's gonna say let's go. Let's go. Okay, come with me. So he's gonna use the uh, the keyboard to move, and then we can use the space to jump. So he's gonna jump here. He's gonna jump here. This is if he wants to jump. And then we get to go here, and then we press the letter E again, and then it's going to say exit to the quad or walk away. So we're going to say exit to the quad. This is the person he's looking for. We're going to press OK, and then we're going to move. Oh, there is a word here. We have to collect it. So we're going to go this way, and then we collect show, S-H-O-W. And then there's a guy here. We want to talk to him. Hello, and welcome to campus. Student services can give you good information. How it's, can I help? Okay. So, what Teresa is going to say? Here again. Hi. Where is Kit? Or good walk away. So, you're going to say, where is Kit? Hi. Where's Kit? I can help you. Can I see your ID first? So he's going to show him. You see? You remember the word show? So, we're going to go here and press... Not option, but we're going to go actions. So we choose here the word show. You remember it? We collected before. And then there is here. He has his own ID. It's 2045. So we'll press here. And then we go do the action. Great. But the date is wrong. Go to the student services office in the student union. As you can see, he has to do a lot of different things to just, you know, with these things, he has to use different languages. Okay, so we're gonna say here thank you or I will how I get the new ID or thank you. I'll go to the office. You can choose whatever you want. There is one wrong, but most of them they're gonna be right. So we're gonna choose this one. Thank you. 
I'll go to the office. All right. Now let me start my presentation. Uh, thank you. Now, I'm going to press here, continue, and then done.